sun splashed Saturday afternoon here in Pittsburgh. Then the state lottery numbers for Carmen. Just his ninth appearance, first start. ERA a little inflated uh, in the walks. You're not used to seeing uh, Carmen handing out free passes last year. He did such a good job out of the bullpen. And so what's in store for this afternoon? And one pitch and a fly ball to Connor Joe. And one out for Majinski wearing Pittsburgh across their chests at home. And they do that again today and they've got two quick outs. Up toward Taylor the former twin and Joe and right. Joe will take it. And a nice tidy one two three inning for Carmen Majinski. I mean Woods Richardson on the mound today for the twins. Start number 10 the innings not super high and not all on him. He's throwing the ball really well. They've, they've been really protective of him. Take a look at that slider 47 percent usage last two he was over 50 percent two starts ago. Andrew McCutcheon playing in his 2059th career game. And hard hit him through. I got a day off yesterday looking reinvigorated 107 miles per hour off the bat. Here is Brian Reynolds two doubles last night bats left handed against the righty and a base hit into center field. For Brian Reynolds and McCutcheon will stroll into second base. Runners at first and second and nobody out. Happening quickly here. It's just three pitches. Team Brian Hayes coming up. This ball is hit well into the right center field gap. Kepler going back on it. He'll make the catch just in front of that 21 foot high Clemente wall. Pirates and Twins go to the second and a nothing nothing ball game. Kepler starts the second for Minnesota. And Majinski takes care of him on three pitches. Castro takes one and will reach first base. Twins get their first base runner. Second time on this trip that Castro has been hit by a pitch. Two out base runner for Byron Buxton and that is going to be it for Carmen Majinski. Derek Shelton is out of the dugout. Majinski faces six batters. Throws 18 pitches as the Pirates manager comes out and will Get the baseball from Majinski. Scoreless game going to the bottom half of inning number two here at BNC Park. Howdy Telez, the hitter. Telez in there for power. 6'4, 270. Ground ball to first. Can they get to Miranda to Correa? Back to Woods Richardson. And the double play erases the leadoff single. Simulating game speed double plays. Miranda playing a position that's not too familiar with him. He comes and gets this thing, clears a lane, fires a throw, and you know once Gray has this ball in his glove that it's game over. Randall down on strikes. And Woods Richardson has another zero. Still zeros on the board. Gonzalez is shaded up the middle. There's a big hole with Rowdy holding the runner on at first base. And Vasky can do that with the best one, especially with a guy who's primarily slider. Sinker, you can stay inside of it. We'll shoot now. To the left side and by Cruz, a base hit for Vasquez, and the Twins have two on to start the third inning. Or you can get out ahead of the slider and go in the six hole. That works just fine as well. Two on and nobody out. Round ball, shortstop, a bobble, picked up by Cruz, steps on the bag, throws to first, and it's a double play. Dropped, recovered, and Cruz still gets. The DP on the play, Kirloff to third. Bottom of the third inning, there's Michael A. Taylor, new papa. The 0-2 pitch, swung on a miss, he struck him out. Down goes Michael A. Taylor, second strikeout in a row for Woods Richardson, one down for the top of the order. And two strikes to Andrew McCutcheon. First go around and now the second time through as well. And in the air to right, going to drop in for a hit. Andrew McCutcheon is two for two. Not bad to take a day off once in a while. The Reynolds, base hit to first. Popped up, third base. Lewis, he's going to have trouble with son, it, and they son, can't son. find it. It drops. Lewis went out and then put his arms out, and then Alex Kirloff, the left fielder, did the same. And it dropped between the two. It'll go as a base hit, putting runners at first and second. Yeah, we knew that was going to be a problem. Uh, we see it every day, well, every Saturday, <laughs> with a 4 o'clock starts. If it's not cloudy and the sun's out, well, the left fielders just have a heck of a time out there with that. This ball has popped up again towards center field. Back lip of the infield this time for Willie Castro and Carlos Correa. Correa grabs it as Buxton comes loping in behind him. And another wonderful job of getting out of a sticky situation by Simeon Woods Richardson. Fourth inning, Pirates and Twins scoreless here at PNC Park. Third baseman Royce Lewis will lead off against Luis Ortiz. Swing and a miss. Struck him out with that sinker. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Came back behind in the count and. He's got back-to-back -back strikeouts here in the fourth. 
Ortiz strikes out the side in the fourth. And the Pirates are rolling. Simeon Woods Richardson is on 43 pitches through three scoreless innings. He faces Cabrian Hayes, Nick Gonzalez, Rowdy Telez. One, two, swung on a missed. He struck him out. Hayes is down as strikeout victim number three. Three, two pitch. Swung on and missed. He struck him out. Great pitch from Simeon Woods Richardson. Boy, it was a slider and it ate him up. Kind of leaked on him a little bit. Gets the strikeout, but still he's like, I didn't execute what I wanted to execute. He knows he's got to be better than that. And that I, I, I like it. I Struck him out. A slider down and in and nowhere close. Woods Richardson punches out three. We're scoreless after four. Eight, nine, and one for the Pirates as Simeon Woods Richardson will face Yasmani Grandal. Ground ball right side. Bobbled. Miranda recovers and throws it past the pitcher. Somehow, some way. Grandal is on first base. That is incredible. Uh, yeah, I don't even have words for that. That is a mezaga. It was picked up and dropped, picked up and dropped. And it had all day because Grandal just is one of the slowest yeah. batter runners in baseball. And then it was just a little oh. underhand flip. And Andrew McCutcheon. Pitch. Swung on a missed. He struck him out. Woods Richardson reared back and found 96. As he dusts off Andrew McCutcheon, his sixth strikeout. Here in the bottom of the sixth inning of a scoreless game. And Hayes awaits the pitch. Come get it. Come on. Lewis cuts in front of Correa and got him at first base. Pirates are signaling safe from the dugout. No, he's out. You see, Keep Bryant already gave his stuff away. He knows he's out. They're going to look at it. Boy, I mean, we're a mile away, but that didn't look that close, did it? No, this, this is, is great. You got to come in and if Royce Lewis at third base, when you take everything you can get, a lot on that throw, and wow, it is a lot closer than we thought initially. After review, the call in the field is confirmed. The runner is out. Pittsburgh has lost their challenge. The runner is out. The inning is over. We've played six. We're scoreless. Stratton pitched on Wednesday against the Dodgers. Uh, two outs, gave up a couple hits and a run. This pitch has popped up. Shallow center field. Taylor coming on. Taylor is going to, ball's going to be caught. The ball is caught somehow, some way by Nick Gonzalez in shallow center field. Spectacular play by Gonzalez. Well, we've seen some uh, great defensive plays here in the last couple of days. And that's right up there with all of them. I mean, you're, you're having to worry about getting run over, too, when you're sliding and making that backhand over the shoulder catch. Simeon Woods Richardson. So there's one away, and here's Rowdy Telez. Telez got booed in his last plate appearance. But kind they, of booing him now. Yeah, they've been riding him a little bit from what I've read. Fly ball center field hit pretty deep. Buxton is back to the track, approaching the wall. And let's get Rowdy! Rowdy Telez hits his first home home run at PNC Park. Gives the Bucks a one nothing cheering for Rowdy. What a moment to do that. What he just did in needing to get some kind of run on the board and he hits it into the hedges. One nothing Pirates in the seventh inning. Big big crowd. Everybody going crazy in the dugout right now. He runs the gauntlet. And now they are all in unison shouting. Listen to this. They want him to come back out for a curtain call. Ryan Jeffers is going to pinch hit for Christian Vasquez. And a ground ball headed up the middle. Backhand play made by Gonzalez. Throw to first. He got him, Nicky. Gee, what a play. Now Gee he, whiz, what a play. Uh, he's having a huge part of what I hope is going to be a win today with that glove of his. Way out in shallow center field. Gave it all he had on his back foot. Threw a strike to Rowdy Telez. Way on the shortstop side, too. Mm. Runners at first and third. Well, the Pirates have the lead. That man right there. And now they're cheering for Rowdy Telez stepping to the plate. And a base hit in left field for Telez. This will score two runs. Rowdy Telez, his coming out party today, gives the Pirates a 3 0 lead. How do you like him now, Pittsburgh? He is Listen the... to this crowd. Listen to this. Everybody's on their feet. It's not <laughs> everybody on their feet. There are almost 30,000 here today. Michael A. Taylor. There's a ground ball into left center field. Telez will score. Rondall to third. Michael A. Taylor, the new papa, delivers. 
And it is 4 0 in the eighth inning. Finds the hole. Again, Correa plays pretty much everybody way over to pull on that left side. But Taylor hits it hard enough. But Taylor hits it hard enough to sneak it through. We've seen a few of those today. Iris looking for back to back shutout wins over the Twins. 3 0 last night. They lead 4 0 here. The pitch. Fly ball left field. Reynolds back toward the track. And makes the catch, raise the Jolly Roger. Back to back shutout wins. The Buccos defeat the Twins by a 4 0 final. That Rowdy, who's been really struggling almost the entire year, to come up at such a big time with that home run, and then later on get the two RBI single, the big hero of the day. Beautiful day at the ballpark.